Yo, what's going on guys? Scotty here back with another YouTube video and anyways what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna be talking about a few things as usual uh, We're doing a little cut commentary, but anyways before I get on to any of my topics or anything like that I just want to thank you guys so much for the support on yesterday's video I didn't know if it was gonna get a lot of support or not uh, just because it was a little bit different of a video It was uh, you know, I was, I was collabing with another youtuber. I was uh you know, trying to spread the subs and everything. I was trying to spread uh, just the community in general. And I really do thank you guys so, so much. Could you drop nine likes on that? That's absolutely amazing. That's more than I've gotten any of my past videos so far. So I really do thank you guys so, so much. And hopefully you guys drop the same amount of support on this video right here. But anyways, let's get right into the topic. The topic I wanted to talk about is uh, I wanted to talk a little bit about RCs and challenges and all this kind of stuff. And now this is one thing that comes to my mind that, you know, I do good and I also struggle with these challenges. Now, a good thing about challenges is, I don't know why, but whenever I go for a challenge, that's when I hit all my clips. I hit, like, all my clips during challenges and stuff like that. I hit it during RCs, challenges, uh, stuff like that. So, that is really good. I hit clips. Uh, and when I don't go for challenges, I kind of, I'm like, alright, well, I'm not really hitting clips. I mean... I do hit clips here and there, like I'll hit quad feeds, but I won't hit anything crazy or nothing like that, but anyways, the other thing with challenges that annoys me is when I am doing challenges, I hit a couple clips, right, I upload it or something, I, I say, oh, here's my first for this, here's my uh, first few for this or whatever, and then I go and look at other people's, and that's what screws you over so much, at least it screws me over. Uh, I look at somebody else and I see their clip. If they even have one good clip in there, I'm like, oh, God. And then that screws with my mind and it, it keeps it in the back of my mind that, oh, this person has a clip. And, uh, oh, this person uh, is going to beat me in the RC. And, you know, I really can't think like that. I have to think of just me. I have to think of just my clips and just what I uh, have to bring to the table. And I don't have to worry about anyone else. So the next RC I go for and all the clips I get, I'm just not going to look at anybody else's responses. I may look at like one or two of my friends uh, just because I do support them and all that. And I kind of know like who they are. I know if they're good enough or not and stuff like that. But I'm not going to look at any other responses. I'm not going to look at any other clips uh, just because I'm going to discourage myself. And I'm going to think that uh, I'm less of... Um, I'm less of a sniper than them if they hit like a five on and I only hit a quad feed the first day. So that's why it's going to bring me down and they're going to be on the upper hand because I, I'm already going to have that feeling of, oh, I'm not going to be able to hit as many clips as them. Oh, I'm not even going to be able to do this when really they could have just got lucky the first day. But I mean, other than that, I don't know if you guys have any uh, tips with RCs or anything like that. But you know, one thing I just have to say about RCs and challenges and uh, montage challenges, all that kind of stuff is just don't look at other people's clips. Be yourself. I think I just got a tweet on my phone. Sorry if you heard that. Uh, but anyways, be yourself. Don't look at other people's clips because it's just going to discourage you. It's going to distract you from hitting your clips. And uh, you know, I've noticed it so, so much. I've done probably three or four challenges so far. Uh, like trying to go for them and then I look at other people's clips and I stop hitting as many clips uh, There was one time I think Gylo's challenge where uh, I didn't look at anybody's clips for the first couple days uh, And I hit four clips in one day next day I hit two more clips and Then after that I hit none four clips one day and then another clip one day and I never hit I haven't hit a clip after that like I've hit quad feet. Um I haven't hit any five ons. I haven't hit anything uh, after that, but anyways, all I'm trying to say is don't look at other people. Just look at what you're doing That's my main tip. I'm trying to get across to you guys because it really will screw you over and uh, You will regret it So I, I don't know just be you don't look at other people is what I'm trying to say Jesus get my point across Jesus But anyways guys, I think that's gonna be I was just talking a little bit about challenges and RC videos and all that kind of stuff But uh, tell me what you guys think about RCs and challenges Tell me if you guys have any tips about uh, going for them, you know, keeping calm or whatever, you know, even just tips about how to make your videos during an RC or anything like that. Tell me if you guys have any tips for that kind of stuff and uh, just tell me anything you want in the comments. Tell me, give, you, give me some feedback and if you could drop a like on this video, that would be much appreciated. My name is Scotty, like, comment, subscribe and we will see you tomorrow.